Okay, guys. So I'm going to watch what I think is the new movie Mowgli. I'm going to watch that trailer and react to it. I thought it was just a teaser that came out, but I guess it's a trailer. I'm not really sure. I just know it's the Jungle Book, and I love the Jungle Book, the animated version and the live-action version. I don't remember how well the live-action version did because I didn't see it or pay any attention to it until it was like on Netflix, and then I was like, oh, check it out. And I loved it, but I don't think my pa- I think my parents hated it, and they saw it in theaters. But, you know, they don't really know anything. They had no reaction on their face when we watched Baby Driver, so I don't really... Anyone who thinks Baby Driver is an awful movie, I do not value your movie opinion. I am sorry if you don't know anything about movies. Because there is no reason that I've heard so far. If you have a reason to not like a movie, then yes. Okay, I value your opinion. Uh, I may not always agree with it, but I'll sit there and listen to it and I'll keep an open mind. But you have to have a good reason. You can't just say it was dumb. And so far, everyone I've heard that has hated Baby Driver, that we talk about it. Everyone that says they hate it, they have no reason other than it's dumb. So, but anyway, uh, other than that, I don't really know anything about this movie. I think it's a Warner Bros. production, but we'll see. Uh, Let's says starring Andy Serkis. Ooh, interesting. Is he going to be Mowgli? I don't know. Let's check out the trailer. I learned stories about the jungle. I lived in a king's palace in a cage just like this. I bit and I scratched and I spent my entire life fighting. Until one day, I just stopped. And I gained their trust. Gained their trust, little brother. The jungle is no longer safe for you. You must stay in the village. It will be all right, little brother. When I found you, all those seasons ago, I thought I couldn't teach you how to belong, but I was wrong, Mowgli. My, my, how you've grown. Sounds like the same but thing. Become a man now, okay. As the jungle book I'm not that came out a couple years ago. Except he was interacting in the village. I think we can both agree, Mowgli, that you are something the jungle has never seen before. Animation doesn't look as good. like that Ka either. Ka didn't keep going the she didn't do the stuttering that she usually does. Or the that was a that was a lisp kinda, but I don't know, that was it looks exactly like the movie 
that came out a couple of years ago, and I'm not sure how I feel about it. I'm gonna watch the trailer again so that I can pick up more bottle things, but I'm not sure. Where does this come out? Did it say? Was I not listening? Was I not paying attention? Comes out in October. Hmm. So yeah, I don't think I don't think Kate Blanchett sounds like a good car, at least that not not that last part. Uh yeah, Shir Khan, Benedict Cumberbatch. Okay, I I knew I knew that voice. Andy Circus was blue. I didn't see him a lot in the trailer. Christian Bale is Bagheera. Okay. I can see that. Pierre Milan as Akila. Eddie Martin. Who's Mowgli? Mohan Chan. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it, it's like the, a Jungle Book that just came out a couple years ago. With a little bit, with some human interaction sprinkled in there, though, because Shere Khan's still the villain. And I just, they already, I, I don't want to say it's redundant. I already did, but I don't want to say it's redundant because, you know, movies get remade all the time. But it's, I feel like it's just so soon to make another live action adaptation, maybe, uh, interpretation, I don't know, it just, the animation looks more CGI than the last one did, and I just feel like it's a step back from where it was, um, I don't know how, how well did the first one do? Jungle Book, um, 2016, 95% of Rotten Tomatoes. Yeah, why are they making this new one? So John Favreau directed the first one. He directed Mowgli. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to see this in theaters. Andy Serkis directed it. That's why they were... Putting emphasis on him. Um, gosh, this this is very interesting because I don't know what else did Andy Circus direct. I like Andy Circus. Like I don't have a problem, but I don't know. I don't know about this new movie that he's doing because it sounds almost exactly the same. Director of Mowgli and Breathe. Breathe was his first directed film. And the inspiring true love story of Robin and Diana Cavendish, an adventurous couple who refused to give them the up in the face of devastating disease, the heart uh, blah blah blah, boing boing boing. Directorial debut of Andy Circus. Andrew Garfield. I've never heard of this movie. Hmm. Must not have done that good. I don't know if it was a UK movie or so I don't know. I don't know. Regardless, I don't think I'm going to go into theaters to see this movie. Let me watch it again. I don't think it's palace. It's just like this. Probably is the darkest time of it. Because having him in the cage is so different than the rest of the story. See, the wolves look funny. Wait, so he was an outcast. So are they saying no because they said they found him as a cub? 
So he wasn't an outcast. He became one. I'm not sure. The wolves just look so funny. You see, they're accepting him in that village. Is it a different village? But now he's a motivational speaker for wolves. The snake is weird, too. I'm... Yeah, no, I will not be seeing this movie in theaters unless I see a different trailer that provokes me to. I'm, I'm not interested in everything I've seen before. I, um, I have a lot of questions, but like I can live with them questions, with those questions being state remaining unanswered. It's just, I don't know if the trailer just didn't do it for me. Or if the movie itself didn't do it for me. If it were something different, like him growing up, going back into the jungle or something. Something that's not the same thing. The unoriginal thing that we've seen a thousand times. Alright. So when it comes out, be on the lookout. Well, when it comes out on DVD, probably be on the lookout for some movie reviews because that's what we'll do. So, in about a year, maybe, it comes out in October, what is it, a month or two in theaters, and like a couple weeks out of theaters, something like that, then it's DVD. But then again, that's what I always thought, but Black Panther is still in my theater, and it just came out on DVD, so. Oh well. Bye guys, have a great day.